Welcome to Sleeping with Strangers. I'm your host, Bo. Today we are visiting Casa de Cai. This is an incredible homestay hostel that is located in Valladolid, Mexico. Casa de Cai offers a wide variety of rooms. They have four bed and six bed dorm rooms. All dorms have a large bathroom, plenty of outlets, air con, and a storage locker big enough for a 60 liter backpack. Casa Takai also has rooms for couples and families that have one, two, or even three beds. These rooms are incredible, especially the rooms upstairs, which have direct access to the upstairs balcony. This balcony can be used for anything from yoga to your morning coffee time. Out back on the ground level, there is a very peaceful hangout area. It has chairs, tables, hammocks, and fast Wi-Fi. If you're planning on working while staying here, this is a great place to do it. If this hasn't persuaded you to book at Casa Takai, just wait. Every morning breakfast is included, with a vegan option always available. By breakfast, I mean a home-cooked breakfast that is local to the area. One morning we had breakfast tacos and the next we had cheese quesadillas. Both breakfasts included fresh fruit that was grown in their garden, coffee, tea, and I have to mention, they were both delicious. This was my favorite hostel I stayed in while traveling in Mexico. Luis and Gabby are the best hosts and go out of their way to make sure your stay is incredible. This hostel was extremely tough to rate. When I was trying to think of something I didn't like, I really couldn't and my rating reflects that. My overall rating of this hostel is friendliness 10. The whole time I was there I felt like family. Cleanliness 10. Their housekeepers are very thorough. Amenities 10. Everything was great, the balconies were awesome, and you could have coffee and tea all day long. Sleeping with strangers factor 10. My roommates were awesome, had no issues, we went out and had drinks every night, so I have to give the SWS factor a 10. All this adds up for an average score of 10. If you're in the area, I highly suggest you stay here. I'll see you next time on Sleeping With Strangers. Bo out. Two more things. Number one, they put your name on your bed. This might seem small, but I love this personal touch and it made me feel right at home. Number two, this is Benito, the hostile kitty. Well, I guess he's more of a cat.